x to the 4 plus x cubed equal to negative 1 and x is a real number. We want to find all possible values of x which x is a real number. So first, let's consider different values. Let's take negative 1 to left hand side so it will be x to the 4 plus x cubed plus 1 equal to 0. If we see this for large x, it will be positive, positive, positive. So one thing that we can say, case one, if x is positive or if x is at least zero, then x to the four plus x cubed plus one will be at least zero to the four plus zero cubed plus one, which is one. So in this case, we don't have any answer. Why? Because we want to reach 0, but here we prove in this case it will be at least this one will be at least 1. Okay, let's consider case 2. If x is, for example, negative, but again, if it is large negative, we can say this part will be, this part will be non-zero part of the equation. So, <clears throat> Because we have x cubed, we have 1, all these things, let's consider x is less than 0, greater than equal, negative 1 is okay. Now, let's consider x to the 4 plus x cubed plus 1. We consider two parts. x to the 4, we know that it is positive. x cubed will be at, because x is greater than negative 1, let's consider x is at least negative 1 here we said so we can say x cubed you can raise both sides to the power of odd number negative 3 always negative 1 so if you add 1 to both sides x cubed plus 1 is greater than or equal to 0 now if you combine these two things we can say that this part uh, let me write this part and this part then x to the 4 plus x cubed plus 1 greater strictly because this one strictly greater than 0 this one greater than equal to 0 so it will be strictly greater than 0 so again in case 2 also we don't have any answer now let's consider in third case that case number 3 x is less than negative 1 so in this case, we want to analyze, again, x to the 4 plus x cubed plus 1. Now we consider, in this case, that it is equal to x cubed times x plus 1 plus 1. We want to analyze this case. We know x is less than negative 1, so we can say that Let's write x is less than negative 1. So x cubed is less than negative 1 or we can say also x cubed is negative. Okay. Now we say okay. Because x is less than negative 1. If we add by 1, x plus 1 will be less than 0. So if we multiply them, x cubed. So here x plus 1 times x plus 1, if we multiply two negative numbers, it will be positive. So we proved this part is positive, so plus 1 is greater than 1. So again here, we proved that we don't have any answer that this one be 0. So we've considered all cases, first x greater than or equal to 0, x between 1, negative 1 and 0, x less than negative 1, and in all cases we proved that there is no real solution so this problem doesn't have any answer this equation doesn't have any answer in real numbers okay so if you want to learn other important ideas in algebra combinatory geometry and number theory and also calculus and other math exams the ideas uh, feel free to send message to my whatsapp number in the description and comments and please don't forget to subscribe turn on the bell and like the video thanks bye